how's it going guys Shelbrox here so I haven't made somebody a Roblox account in ages it's probably been months so in this video we are going to be making a Scar Lord a Roblox account so if you do not know who Scar Lord is he's basically like a metal trap rapper he's actually from the UK um, if you haven't seen his music make sure you check it out it's really good and um, pretty unique kind of music so you've got to have a kind of unique music taste to actually like it but yeah I like it it's really good stuff and let's go ahead and design a him on Roblox so these are the pictures I'm going to be kind of like using they're from the music video bands and um yeah he's basically got like a tactical vest a white shirt and um, some jeans he's got a mask he's got obviously his hair and he's got kind of like some ski goggles so let's try and make him on roblox so the first thing I've already done is I've actually made a Scarlord shirt and pants and um, basically I looked on the Roblox catalogue and the ones on there were really low quality so I've made my own one, um, I just made it before the video so that is what it looks like. I think it's pretty close to what his one looks like, obviously it's not going to be exactly the same but it's a pretty good copy. Now I've also got some jeans as well and um, these are jeans that I've already had on my group so I will be using these. If you guys want to get this shirt or jeans um, I will leave a link to them in the description of this video. Video. so you can check it out and if you want to make Skylord as well you can go ahead and get these or if you think they look cool and um, like these jeans I really like them you can go ahead and use these on your avatar as well so I think the first thing we should probably do is find his hair so let's go over to the catalog right now let's go into hmm, what would it be under accessories and hair I guess okay so he kind of has like really dark brown almost black hair maybe this chestnut style we could get this and mix it with something else um, brown hair as well um, that might be good but it's a bit long maybe this one so what I'll do is I'll open up a few hairs and maybe they will work maybe this one as well so yeah his hair is kind of weird actually I don't think we're going to be able to get that exactly right so yeah definitely not this one um, we might be able to use this one and kind of combine it yeah so maybe that one maybe this one as well so yeah we could probably add both of these hairs together and then we've also got is this gonna work probably not so I actually already had those two that I was thinking of buying I must have bought this and um, so what we're gonna do let's go and look for some goggles so he also kind of has ski goggles um, are they even called that ski goggles I don't actually know what what are they actually called um, like bike goggles Okay, these ones, I've actually got these already. Yep, okay, so these look good. The blue dirt bike goggles, the black ones look even better actually, or the red ones. Unfortunately, I can't buy these. I don't even have Builders Club, so. Yeah, they don't actually make Builders Club stuff anymore, but I can't even buy this. So yeah, we're just gonna have to go back on that. And um, I think we're just gonna have to deal with the blue one, I guess. That's probably the best option we've got. Okay, so we've got the hair, we've got the goggles. Now what we need to do is find his mask. So he has a black face mask. So if we just type in mask, I guess. Actually, there is a good one called Bandit. There is Surgeon Mask, but that's kind of like, you know, it's a normal Surgeon Mask. He needs like a black one, so. Is it Bandit? It's like the best one. Like this one right here. I think that would probably look pretty good over on his avatar. Okay, so let's go ahead and start creating it now. Let's go over into my avatar section and let's begin putting the stuff on. So the first thing we're going to do, I think let's try and get the hair right. So let's put the... Um, okay, so we've got a few. So we could try and combine them. So bed hair, we could try and use this as well. Oh my god, that looks pretty crazy. I think we're going to go with the brown one. And maybe we can add this on top. If you do not know how to combine hair, basically you copy the ID of one of them. So you just copy this part at the top. And then you need to go onto advanced in the hair section. And what you can do is paste it in and you can actually have two hairs at one. So that's a pretty good tip. I think most people know, maybe you didn't. So there you go, that is looking pretty crazy. Kind of like his hair. Would have been better if it was a lot darker. But there isn't really anything we can do, I guess. And now what we need to do is go into clothing as well. And we need to go into face. We need to find the bandit mask, which I already bought a while ago and it's this one right here so let's equip that straight away I think that was one of the first things I got when I got Builders Club for the first time because I thought that was really cool okay so now what we should do is probably equip his goggles let's put these ones on the blue dirt bike goggles okay so there you go guys looking pretty like him I'd say the hair could be darker but there isn't really too much we can do I guess so let's go into shirts and let's put Scarlord on let's go into pants and let's put these ripped jeans um, with the chains on okay so that is looking pretty cool now now we need to go into body and skin tone we need to choose Scarlord skin tone is it maybe this one right here 
And there you go, guys. I think that is pretty much done. If we just give it a compare right now, so just looking at the normal one, the pants pretty much look the same. The shirt and the tactical vest look the same. The goggles could have been all black, but it still looks pretty decent. The mask um, blends in well with the tactical vest and it looks good. Um, the hair isn't exactly right, but I think that's the best we can probably do on Roblox. So what we can actually do is we can put some animations on. We can also put R15 on right here. Um, if we put the toy animation, that is actually my favorite one. So I'm just going to put, actually, let's just put this on. This is the animations I normally use. It's kind of weird, but I use all these in a combo. And there you go. That is Scarlord. So maybe we could add some other stuff. And um, there isn't much point in choosing a face. Obviously, we can't see it. But let's give him a monster smile anyway, because that is a cool one. And there you go. That is what Scarlord looks like. So I think it's pretty close. Um, but let's go and join a game. And let's see what he looks like inside of a game. So we are over on a game right now and apparently this is like an abandoned Disney world or something. It looks kind of crazy. I think it's a classic game. There aren't actually many abandoned place like games on Roblox that look really cool. Um, so yeah, if you didn't know most of his music videos, he goes to like these cool abandoned places. They look really nice. And it looks like we've got a rusted up Mickey Mouse here. And I think this game is actually like got so many viruses on it because if you look at all the signs in here All of the decals are actually flipped upside down. So yeah, this game is pretty screwed up I guess but that is pretty much it for this video. This is what Scarlet looks like on Roblox Let me know what you think. Do you think I got it right or could I've made it better? Who knows? So that is pretty much it for this video if you guys enjoyed make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one